Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me. I am back with another video just like I am every single Friday. Today I am back trying the Jeffree Star Liquid Lip Mini Rainbow Bundle. Ow, just hit myself in the face. Um, if you haven't been watching this channel for the past six weeks or so, I've been using each color of the Jeffree Star Liquid Lips. Oh my God, my computer. I want it to show the YouTube logo. <laughs> Let me fix that. <sighs> um, so yeah, I've been trying these liquid lipsticks for the past few weeks, um, using a different color every week. I think I have two left now, the dark blue and the purple. Um, I have really, really loved these colors. The formula is freaking amazing and they're just so fun. I love these colors. But anyway, getting into today's actual look, it's very Valentine's Day inspired. Um, uh, it is the day after Valentine's Day today. Um, so I'm a bit of a failure at scheduling things to land on the right days. Um, but that's okay. Um, in my opinion, we should be pulling out fun looks every day of our lives, not just for the holidays. Um, but yeah, this one's super cute. You can use it for not just Valentine's Day, but fun dates, going clubbing, laying at home, looking cute, which is what I do. <laughs> um, yeah. I have lipstick on my tooth, that's good. If you like what you see in here, to see how to get it, keep watching. <laughs> so I've already put my base down, it was just highlight, contour and foundation. I did quite a light coverage today, so you can still sort of see what I look like. So I still look like a bit of a trash can, but that's just because I don't know. I don't really have a reason. So, um, yeah, I just used light coverage. Today, um, you can use full coverage since this is like a, um, sort of a date look. A little bit of a Valentine's inspired thing. I know Valentine's Day was yesterday, but I don't care. Yeah, so anyway, um, getting into the next Steps, um, since it is a very lovely inspired thing, um, I do want to put a bit of blush on just to make us look a little bit alive, I guess. Because we're all dead inside. So we're going for a very simple eye look. Um, I did a look, um, I don't know, actually it was quite a few weeks back now, maybe four or five weeks ago, where I did an orange lip and a blue winged powder. That doesn't make any sense. Eyeshadow. Um, I'm going to do that same concept, just with red. So I want it to be very red. Um... James Charles Palette, of course, using the red shade on our eyeballs. Let's do it. I'll show you where it should go. So I just start filling in my lid first. Danger, I got a lot of fallout just then, so I'm just gonna pop some powder under my eyes so that it doesn't rub. <sighs> Stunning. Fierce. Why do I keep sticking my tongue out today? I can't help it. It just keeps flopping out. Okay, so there's the red wing part done. I just want to pop my eyebrows in so it doesn't look um, 
my face doesn't look so naked because I feel naked. So at this point, you could always um, dust some of the red shadow under your eye as well so it looks really like joined and smoky, but I personally like that um, sort of uneven blunt look. Um, I think it's fun. So I'm just going to pop my mascara on now. Obviously you could do fake lashes as well. Valentine's Day looks are perfect to do um, fake lashes with because you just look so cute. You can see how much of a difference mascara makes between this eye and this eye. Like, it's just a bit more completed. I, um, for the longest time, didn't use mascara at all. Like, I would do my full face of makeup and just not put on lashes or mascara. Which sort of, like, confuses me now because I'm like, I literally look naked if I haven't added the lashes part. So since I'm calling this my date night look, um, for a date night I would definitely do a lot more highlight. It's sort of like popping on my nose but not so much on my cheekbones. Um, so I would probably add that as like an extra thing. Um, but for now I'm going to leave it. I also think for some... For some extra like fun, um, obviously not so much if you aren't the kind of person who does this, but me, um, I would put some I thought I heard someone in the house. Scary. Um okay now I'm so scared to talk. Anyway, um, if you're the kind of person who does like to look a little bit ridiculous, I would add some gems. Um, obviously I'm going to use the red ones today. I used the pink ones last week for my brats look. Um, so let's just pop those on. That's so cute. Um, so now... Let's put our lips on. And for the lips, I'm having a little bit of a, like, I don't know what to call it. Like, I'm not sure what to do because I think that I want to add gloss. I want to have a glossy red lip, but I don't know if the gloss that I have is going to make it a weird color. So let's try this first. There you go. That's with the red lip. That is so cute. Red is such a good color. Like, just classic. I would wear it for any look. Um, a lot of times when I go to work, I just wear red lipstick just because it sort of looks like you put in a little bit of effort when really you didn't. Um, but yeah, so that is it for a really simple valentine's day or date look that's still a little bit bold there's a lot of red happening and it's good um now i don't know if we should attempt this whole gloss situation i have this one from nyx i got it recently it's a duo chrome chromatic shimmer lip gloss and I feel like, yeah, it's like a really pigmented. So I feel like the gloss is just gonna take over the red. Right. So I guess that's also an option to put the gloss on. Um, personally, I just like the red matte. The, the gloss is probably like a, um, Another kind of look. Um, <laughs> it's 
So anyway, I guess that's it for today. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a good day. Goodbye. Goodbye. I don't know what to say now. <laughs> I'm just taking the look you just saw off at the moment. And I forgot to mention earlier that um, next week's video is going to be a Q&A. So if you haven't already submitted your questions, do that. <laughs> um, you can DM me on Instagram. Um, I don't know how else you do it, but if however you can get in contact with me, let me know if you have any questions about makeup, about me, a question about your life that you want me to solve, because I'm going to answer it all next Friday.